let us see the types of RNA. There are three major types of RNA which occur in all organisms. They are messenger RNA that is mRNA, transfer RNA that is tRNA and ribosomal RNA that is rRNA. Let us know about the messenger RNA. As the name suggests, mRNA carries the genetic information from DNA to the ribosomes. Genetic informations on the DNA are transcribed into the mRNA by a process called transcription. Here the message is translated into action that is, based on the genetic information, different types of proteins are synthesized. The type of gene that is involved in protein synthesis depends upon their strength, kinds and sequence of nucleotides. It is about 3 to 5 percent of the RNA content of the cell. The mRNA is always single stranded. The mRNA is produced as a complementary copy of the DNA which is involved in protein synthesis. Let us know about transfer RNA. Transfer RNA is also known as soluble RNA, sRNA. The tRNA is a small molecule compared with other types of RNAs. It amounts to about 15% of total RNA of the cell. The tRNA molecule performs a number of functions. The most important one is to act as a carrier of amino acid to the site of protein synthesis. There are about more than 20 types of tRNAs. Each tRNA is a specific for a particular amino acid. In bacterial cell, there are more than 70 tRNAs and in eukaryotic cells, the number is even greater. There are 4 or 5 tRNAs specific for a particular amino acid and these are called isoacceptor tRNAs. Describe ribosomal RNA. This is found in the ribosomes. The rRNA represents about 40 to 60 percent of the total weight of the ribosomes. Relatively, it constitutes about 80 percent of the total RNA of the cells. They are produced in the nucleus. They are the most stable forms of RNA. They consist of single strand of nucleotides. At some regions, the strand is folded.